1999, a new upstart band of Oregon starter rockets with electrified instruments, boasting fanciful promises to lead us into the new century with gusto. Here's for to them, showcasing their caterwauling at a local speakeasy in Upper Darby, PA. Puppets or snake oil salesmen? Only time will tell, but we've got you covered. Watch this space! Except the Conquer Fishtown. I think we've, uh, we've we've made a dent in Fishtown. Uh, there's a few people that come back. Tangerine was the first song that we jammed on, and it was pretty bad. But uh, we got a little bit better since then. Not much, but uh, that's where it starts for me. I think it was 2004. We had rehearsal at Joe's old place, and I just said, It's a Flyers playoff game. Let's go to the bar and scrap rehearsal. And Jeremy Lomick scored in overtime to eliminate the Maple Leafs. That is my all-time favorite memory of this band. The funny thing is, yeah, with uh, growing up with Pat, I've heard the songs like my whole life. So when I started playing in the band, I would just. I already knew them. It was natural. Yeah. Yeah. Probably the harder part is uh, working with Joe. <laughs> I've never seen that. <laughs> out of context. It was, <laughs> because he's your landlord. Yeah, he's now my landlord. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Actually, every waking moment I have with my band is my favorite memory. Like this memory right now is my favorite memory. The last time we had practice was my favorite memory to that point. And so and so forth and so on. Back. Yeah. Back in like 2005, when my brother's 30th, he was decided to play for like all his friends with the band, and the drummer decided to not show up. So, me being the dorky little brother, I was always listening to the songs and playing them myself, so I was able to step in and play without any practice, play better than any of those assholes either. I uh, joined a uh, few. 2018, they say, when I filled in for Jim, and then I filled in for Joe at a later date, I still considered myself to go a substitute, but my favorite show would have been Penn Treaty Park. I feel like that, when I played guitar, I was actually solid in the band. We've had a lot of different lineups, and this lineup is really cool because everyone can play multiple instruments. Uh, we have like four drummers in this band, we might, maybe one day we'll play a show with four drummers, I don't know. I don't, what would that sound like? At Beauty 35 at 25, is truly a band or 